Hello students, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be discussing 100 MCQs on political science. I will discuss about political theory and political thinkers, comparative politics and Indian polity, international relation and India's foreign policy, public administration, public policy and political process in India. These topics are very important for many competitive exams. So be with this video till the end. If you didn't subscribe my channel yet, please hit the subscribe button. Click the bell icon so that you can get the notification of my new videos. Who in his book Two Concepts of Liberty classified the concept of liberty into positive and negative liberty? He is Aijia Verlin. Option B is the correct option. Public administration consists of all those operations having for their purpose the fulfillment or enforcement of public policy. Who said this? Options are given to you. What is the correct option for this question? The correct option is option D. L.D. White. Who propounded the philosophical idea of well of ignorance to determine the basic institutions and structures of a just society? It is John Rawls. Who is the author of the book New Patterns of Management? It is Lancis Likert. Which among the following is not associated with Mao Zedong? Let us see one by one. Long March, it is related to him. Cultural Revolution, it is also re related to Mao Zedong. The Little Red Book, it is also related. One Country, Two System, it is not related to Mao Zedong. Which theory was asserted by Hirschberg? The correct option is option C, hygiene motivation theory. Match list 1 with list 2 and select the correct answer using the codes given below. In list 1, all thinkers' names are given. You have to match thinkers with their famous work. Machiavelli is related to discourses on Levy. Hobbes famous work is Levy Athan. Locke, two treaties of civil government. Rousseau, social contact. So the correct option is option D. Who is the creator of efficiency? F. W. Taylor. Who is the writer of Fatwa e Jahandari? This is the famous work of Jiadun Varani. Manu has given how many Vyavharik Paksha practical aspects of judicial process? This is four Vyavharik Paksha. Which of the following books was authored by Antonio? Graham C. Prison Notebooks is the famous work of Antonio Graham C. Who called National Development Council as per Super Cabinet? K. Santhanam. According to Javed Nama of Muhammad Iqbal, how many stages are in the development of ego? This is 7. According to which article of the constitution, the president is an integral part of the parliament. In parliament, there are three components, president, Lok Sabha, 
and Raj Sabha. This is according to Article 79. The watchman cannot be greater than treasure. Treasurer will remain smaller than treasure. In which reference Pandit Deen Dayal Upadhyay said this. This is individualism. In which book Pandita Ramavai wrote that self-confidence and self-defendence are the foundation of women's progress? The high caste Hindu women is one of the famous works of Pandita Ramavai. The correct option is option A. Who has given the concept of new humanism? The new humanism concept was given by M and Y. How many types of non-violence are there as mentioned by Mahatma Gandhi? There are three types of non-violence mentioned by Mahatma Gandhi. Under which article of the Indian constitution the provision was made for having two houses of a state legislature? It is article 168. Which country adopted the great leap forward policy? This is China. In China, Mao Zedong adopted the concept of the Great Leap Forward policy. Under whose leadership Naxalbari movement started? The correct option is option A, Charu, Majumdar and Kanu Sanyal. Who among the following is considered as the father of development administration? George Gant is considered as the father of development administration. Consider the following human rights conventions and arrange them as per its year-wise chronological order. First, genocide and punishment related convention. Then, Convention on End of Racial Discrimination, Convention for the Elimination of Discrimination Against Women, Convention on Children's Right. Correct option is option B. Genocide and Punishment Related Convention adopted in 1948. Convention on End of Racial Discrimination, it was adopted in 1965. Convention for the Elimination of Discrimination Against Women, adopted in 1979. Convention on Children's Rights, adopted in 1989. A welfare state is a state which provides for its citizens a wide range of social services. This definition is given by, it was given by N. Who among the following is not the supporter of the realistic approach? The correct option is option B, George S. Craver Jan Bagger. Choose from the following the book written by the new liberalistic Kenneth Waltz. The correct option is Theory of International Politics, 1979. Let us see the books. Scientific Man vs. Power Politics. It was written in 1946 by Hans Morgenthau. Theory of International Politics, written in 1979 by Kenneth Waltz. In defense of National Interest, 1951, Hans Morgenthau. Dilemmas of Politics, 1958, Hans Morgenthau. 
we must make our political democracy a social democracy as well political democracy cannot last unless there lies at the base of it social democracy whose statement is this this is the famous statement of b r ambedkar how many member states are in european union at present 27 which article empowers the president of india to appoint a backward classes commission to investigate the condition of the socially and economically backward classes the correct option is option c article 340 In reference to Yalta Conference, February 1945, which of the following heads of state had participated? Britain, America, Soviet Union. At Yalta, U.S. President Franklin D. Roosevelt, British Prime Minister Winston Churchill, and Soviet Premier Joseph Stalin made important. decisions regarding the future progress of the war and the post war world there are four national institutes in its major area of disability under the ministry of welfare match the four institutes with their headquarters location national institutes for orthopedically handicapped This institute is located in Mumbai. National Institute for Visually Handicapped. It is situated in Secunderabad. National Institute for Mentally Handicapped. This is located in Dehradun. National Institute for Speech and Hearing Handicapped. This is located in Kolkata. So the correct option is option C. One for all and all for one is the watchword of the collective security. The author of above statement is that is Organsky. Which of the following statements are important about the importance of public policy to give shape to the constitutional provisions this is correct to set goals for development works this is also correct for proper utilization of resources this is also correct to give direction to dictatorship this is not correct so the correct option is option C In reference to Bretton Woods Conference, which one of the following is not correctly matched? Year of the conference, 1944. This is correct. Major international institutions, the IMF and IBRD. This is also correct. Date of the conference, from July 1 to 22. This is also correct. Number of countries participated, 45. this is not correct because number of countries participated 44 the bretton woods conference was held in bretton woods new hampshire united states in july 1944 it was attended by delegates from 44 allied nations who gathered to establish a new international monetary system and address the economic problems facing the world after world war 2 the conference led to the creation of two major international institutions the international monetary fund imf and international bank for reconstruction and development ibrd which later became part of the world bank group with reference to the international monetary fund consider the following statement it was established on 27 december 1945 this is correct 
to promote international trade and economic progress of member states this is also correct it consists of one board of governors which is working as general assembly this is not correct so the correct option for this question is option d the board of governors is the highest decision making body of the imf it consists of one governor and one alternate governor for each member country the governor is appointed by the member country and usually the minister of finance or the head of the central bank which is not an approach of public policy the correct option is logical positivism approach mm -hmm. the concept of policy sciences was developed by whom and when it was developed by loswell in 1951 so the correct option is option a the concept of policy sciences was first formulated by Herod Laswell in 1951 in his work on the policy orientation this work is also very important and it was co-edited with Daniel Lerner this work is regarded as the first systematic effort towards building a new field of inquiry to deal with social problems The Pansil Agreement served as the foundation for relations between two countries. It was India and China. The correct option is option A. With reference to the Indo-Sri Lanka Agreement, consider the following statements. It is popularly known as Rajiv Jayawardene Agreement. This is correct. It was signed to resolve the Sri Lanka civil war. this is also correct the agreement saw the placement of the indian peace keeping force in sri lanka the correct option is option d in which year raj sabha formed an ethics committee in india it was 1997 the raj sabha constituted its first ethic panel on march 4 1997 which was inaugurated by then vice president and host chairman k r narayanan on may 30 1997 in india who was the first president of the human right commission rangnath misra According to under which article the president of India has right to address the joint session of both the houses of parliament it is article 86 1 option C is the correct option According to article 87 of the constitution there are two instances when the country's president specifically addresses a joint sitting of both houses they are at the start of the first session after a general election this is when the reconstituted lok sabha meets for the first time after being elected at the start of the first session every year who wrote the book the rise of network society it is manuel castells In how many days Gandhi ji had completed his Dandi march? In 24 days. Option C is the correct option. Salt Satyagraha march started on 12th March 1930 from Sabarmati ashram and reached Dandi after 24 days on 6th April 1930. On which date and year the local self-government units of urban areas have given constitutional foundation it is 1st june 1993 the 74th constitutional amendment act 1992 74th constitutional amendment act came into effect on 1st june 1993 introduced part 9a 
the municipalities which deals the issues relating to municipalities the act provided constitutional status to the urban local bodies when did president radha krishnan declare emergency it was 26th october 1962 the very first national emergency was declared in october 1962 due to chinese hostility in northeast frontier agency which was continued till january 1968 duration of this emergency was october 1962 to january 1968 this duration is also very important which of the following statements is not correct about the constituent assembly of india let us see the statement one by one the constituent assembly has altogether held 11 sessions this is correct the constituent assembly first met on the 12th of december 1946 it is not correct because the constituent assembly first met on the 9th of december 1946 these 11 sessions of constituent assembly have consumed 165 days this is also correct the assembly has spent 114 days for the consideration of the draft constitution this is also correct so the correct option for this question is option b let us see some important facts about this topic so that you can solve many direct as well as indirect questions related to this topic the constituent assembly it took 2 years 11 months and 17 days since it first met on the 9th of december 1946 during this period the constituent assembly has all together held 11 sessions these 11 sessions are very important for exam perspective out of these 11 sessions the first six were spent in passing the objectives resolution and the consideration of reports of committees on fundamental rights on union constitution on union powers on provincial constitutions on minorities and on the scheduled areas and scheduled tribe ji these points are very important for exam perspective the 7th 8 9th 10th and the 11th sessions were devoted to the consideration of the draft constitution this point is also very important these 11 sessions of the constituent assembly have consumed 165 days out of these the assembly has spent 114 days for the consideration of draft constitution which is the formula for corruption given by robert klitgard the correct option is option b c is equal to m plus d minus a plus i plus t let us see what is it c represents corruption m represents monopoly power d represents discretion a represents accountability i represents integrity and t represents transparency the formula originally appeared in klitgard's 1988 book controlling corruption this book is also very important which of these is not a correct criticism of aristotle supporting slavery this is correct denying citizenship to women this is also correct denying citizenship to disabled this is correct regarding a state as a moral institution this is not correct option is option d aristotle did not regard the state as a moral institution instead he viewed the state as a natural institution necessary for fulfilling human needs and facilitating virtue in its citizens 
This concept is different from viewing the state as inherently moral or ethical. Who said that those who are dissatisfied with the constitution have only to opt in is two-thirds majority in the parliament. But if they cannot earn two-thirds majority in adult franchise basis elected parliament, then this must be understood that people are not with them for their dissatisfaction against constitution. Option A, Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. With which of the following tribal community is Sahada movement associated? This is Will community. Option C. The author of the book Dalit Visions is Gail Omvet. What are the official languages of a state administration in Uttar Pradesh, India? Hindi and Urdu. Option D. The languages of a state administration in Uttar Pradesh, India are Hindi and Urdu. Hindi was established as an official language by the Uttar Pradesh Official Language Act 1951 while Urdu was included as an official language through an amendment to the same act in 1989. Self-employed women's association worked for the women in the unorganized sector was formed by whom? Ilabat. At present, which of the following states has not a part of Vimaru state in India? This is Kerala. Vimaru is an acronym coined by demographer Asis Bose in mid-1980s formed from the first letters of name of some of poorest Indian states, namely Bihar, Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan and Uttar Pradesh. What was the prime focus in the second phase of federal reorganization of states? Northeast India. Which of the following state is not popularly related with Khaf Panchayat. This is Himachal Pradesh. Who among the following suggested to have Lok Sabha and a state assembly's elections simultaneously from the year 2024? Niti Ayog. To address the politics of language, which commission agreed to take effective steps to implement the three language formula? This was Sarkaria Commission. Who said about bureaucracy, its hierarchy is a hierarchy of knowledge? Karl Marx. According to which of the following commission's report, the state of Telangana came into existence? This is Justice B. N. Sri Krishna Commission, Option B. Who coined the term scientific management for what is considered the first systematic theory of organization? This is Luis de Bernardis. The term scientific management was first of all given by Luis Bernandes in 1910. Taylor gave much concentration on the supervisory level. Who defined development administration as an action-oriented, goal-oriented administrative system? 
एडवर्ड वेडनर ऑप्शन सी हु डेवलप्ड कंटिजेंसी थ्योरी फॉर लीडरशिप Fred Fidler. Which of the following measures suggested by Paulette herself is the best in her view to manage conflict in an organization? This is integration. Option C is the correct option. To overcome conflict in a constructive way in an organization, Paulette has suggested three methods: domination. compromise and integration there are four types of e governance which one among the following is not a type of e governance this is government to market g to m there are four types of e governance they are government to citizens government to employee government to business government to government the swachh bharat mission program comes under which ministry of the central government it comes under ministry of jal shakti option d ma griddha kasyas vidhanam is the motto of which institution This is the motto of Lokpal of India. Option B is the correct option. Motto Ma Gridha Kasyas Vidhanam, meaning "Do not be greedy for anyone's wealth," is mentioned on Lokpal website. According to the CMS India Corruption Study in 2017. Which Indian state was reported as the least corrupt? It was Himachal Pradesh. The Indian state with the highest reported corruption cases in 2022 was Maharashtra with 749 cases. Kerala is the least corrupted state in India. Mahatma Gandhi National Rural Employment Guarantee Scheme is fully funded through Rural Employment Security Fund. Economic and social planning is included in which list of the constitution? Concurrent list. Which bill passed in 2020 granted official status to five languages? including kashmiri hindi dogri english and urdu official languages amendment act 2020 the official languages amendment act 2020 was passed in 2020 granting official status to five languages kashmiri hindi dogri english and urdu this move aimed to recognize and promote linguistic diversity within the respective regions which of the following statement are correct for parliamentary public account committee which is formed to control public expenditure first it is formed for its financial year this is correct its member included 15 from lok sabha and 7 from rajya sabha this is also correct its main function is to check the report of controller and auditor general this is also correct it has total 30 members this is not correct its chairman is appointed by the finance minister this is also not correct so the correct option is option d 1 2 3 the budget is presented in the rajya sabha during the general discussion on budget in the lok sabha option d who wrote two political cultures emerged in post independent india which are operating at different levels of india paul r brass which 
legislation led to the formation of the union territories of Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh. This is Jammu and Kashmir Reorganization Act 2019. The Jammu and Kashmir Reorganization Act 2019 passed by both houses of the Parliament of India in August 2019 led to the reconstitution of the former state of Jammu and Kashmir into two union territories, Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh, with effect from 31st October 2019. Which of the following Indian states union territories is not part of the Indian Himalayan region? This is Jharkhand. The Indian Himalayan region spans 13 Indian states and union territories, including Ladakh, Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Sikkim, West Bengal, Manipur, Meghalaya, Mizoram, Nagaland, Tripura, Assam, and Arunachal Pradesh. Which of the following Indian states does not celebrate November 1st as State Formation Day? This is Maharashtra. November 1st is celebrated as a State Formation Day for eight Indian states. These eight states' names you must need to know. Karnataka, Kerala, Madhya Pradesh, Punjab, Haryana, Rajasthan, Andhra Pradesh, and Chhattisgarh. This day marks the establishment of these states, commemorating their formation and historical significance. What significant action was taken by the Indian Parliament regarding the state of Jammu and Kashmir in August 2019? This is revocation of Article 370. In August 2019, the Indian Parliament passed resolution seeking the revocation of the temporary special status granted to the state of Jammu and Kashmir under Article 370 of the Indian Constitution. Additionally, a reorganizing bill was introduced to divide the state into two union territories to be governed by a lieutenant governor and unicameral legislature. This significant move led to the nullification of the provisions of autonomy previously granted to the state. Which of the following is are true regarding conditions of office of the governor? For governor of two states, the emoluments are divided amongst the states as decided by the president. This is correct. Governor during his term cannot be arrested or imprisonment for criminal proceedings. This is also correct. The oath of office to the governor is administered by the Chief Justice of the Concerned State High Court. This is also correct. So the correct option is option D. Let us know some important facts. Article 153. There shall be a governor for each state provided that nothing in this article shall prevent the appointment of the same person as governor for two or more states. Article 154, the executive power of the state shall be vested in the governor and shall be exercised by him either directly or through officers subordinate to him in accordance with the constitution. Article 155, Appointment of Governor. The Governor of a state shall be appointed by the President by warrant under his hand and seal. 
which of the following are true regarding the public account committee it was set up first under the provisions of government of india act of 1909 this is not correct because it was set up under the provisions of government of india act of 1919 chairman of the committee is selected from the opposition party this is correct it examines the appropriation accounts and the finance accounts of the union government this is also correct its recommendations are advisory this is correct a minister cannot be elected as a member of the committee this is also correct so the correct option is option c public account committee was set up first in 1921 under the provisions of the government of india act of 1919 and has since been in existence at present it consists of 22 members 15 from the lok sabha and 7 from the rajya sabha the chairman of the committee is appointed from amongst the members by the speaker since 1967 a convention has developed whereby the chairman of the committee is selected from the opposition which of the following is a true regarding estimates committee the origin of this committee can be traced to 1921 this is correct there are no members from rajya sabha in it this is also correct so the correct option is option b the origin of this committee can be traced to the standing financial committee set up in 1921 the first estimates committee in the post independence era was constituted in 1950 on the recommendation of john mathai and then finance minister originally it had 25 members but in 1956 its membership was raised to 30 all the 30 members are from lok sabha only the rajya sabha has no representation in this committee the president of india is elected by an electoral college comprising of elected members of both houses of parliament and state legislative assembly article 53 of the constitution of india states that the president can exercise their powers directly or by subordinate authority though all of the executive powers vested in the president are in practice exercised by the prime minister heading the council of ministers the president is bound by the constitution to act on the advice of the council and to enforce the decrees passed by the supreme court under article 142 the prime minister union cabinet minister chief minister and council of ministers are all members of these all are the members of national development council option a is the correct option the national development council or rashtriya vikas parishad is the apex body for decision creating and deliberations on development matters in india presided over by the prime minister founded on 6 august 1952 John Ross conceives of the original contract as one to establish the principles of justice for the basic structure of society. John Ross pioneered the concept of justice as fairness, proposing a society where principles are chosen without knowledge of one's own position, ensuring impartiality. His ideas have had a profound impact on political theory and discussion of social justice worldwide. Which ideology did Jawaharlal Nehru find intellectually stimulating for understanding historical processes? This is Marxism. 
Jawaharlal Nehru expressed his appreciation for Marxism, stating the Marxian philosophy appeals to me in a broad sense and helps me to understand the process of history. Arrange the following Mahatma Gandhi's ashram institutions in chronological order. Phonic settlement, then Tolstoy farm, Kochrav ashram, Sevagram ashram. A, D, B, C. Option A is the correct option. Phonic settlement, it was founded by Mahatma Gandhi in 1904 in German, South Africa. Tolstoy Farm was established by Mahatma Gandhi in South Africa in 1910. The Kochrab Ashram was the first ashram established by Mahatma Gandhi after coming to India from South Africa in 1915. It was 1936 when Mahatma Gandhi left Savarmati Ashram and set up his ashram in Sevagram a small village in Varda town in Maharashtra. With Satyagra combined with Ahinsa, you will bring the world to your pit. Who said this? Mahatma Gandhi. Who condemned natural rights as an invention of fantasy? Bentham. Who insisted that type of government depended on economic and geographic factor? This is Jean Baudin. World system analysis was first presented by Emmanuel Wallerstein. Identify the correct chronological sequence of the following. Sankari Prasad versus Union of India. Lal Bahadur Sastri as Prime Minister. Formation of Bangladesh. Mandal Commission. So the correct sequence is 1, 4, 2, 3. Option B is the correct option. Let us know some important facts about these topics. Sankari Prasad versus Union of India is the famous landmark decision of Indian judiciary took place in 1951. Mandal Commission established in 1979 by the Janta Party government under Prime Minister Moraji Desai with a mandate to identify the socially and educationally background classes of India. Formation of Bangladesh took place on 26th March 1971. Lal Bahadur Sastri served as the second Prime Minister of India from 1964 to 1966. Which one of the following pairs is not correctly matched? Let us see the pairs one by one. As Simon, administrative behavior, this is correct. Dwight Waldo, ideas and issues in public administration, this is also correct. Rani Slickert, the human organization, this is also correct. A. Adjioni, the practice of management, this is not correct. So, the correct option for this question is option B. The practice of management originally published in 1954. Author of this book was Peter Drucker. Which one among the following is not a member of G8 countries? Options are given to you. Which is the correct option? The correct option is China. Option D. Let us see some important facts about G8 countries. The group of eight refers to a group of eight highly industrialized nations. France, Germany, Italy, the United Kingdom, Japan, the United States, Canada and Russia. Hence, China is not a member of G8. Who among the following authors is not associated with Realist school. This is Aldous Huxley. Option D is the correct option. Axel Hagerstrom is regarded as the founder of the realist school. 
This school is also known as the Upasala School of Jurisprudence, a branch of the sociological school and the left wing of the functional school. Match the list 1 with list 2 and select the correct answer from the codes given below. C2, it was founded in 1954. Sark, it was founded in 1985. NATO, in 1949. Warsaw Pact, in 1955. So the correct option is option A. In September of 1954, the United States, France, Great Britain, New Zealand, Australia, the Philippines, Thailand and Pakistan formed the South East Asia Treaty Organization of CETO. The South Asian Association for Regional Corporation SARC was established on 8 December 1985. These dates are very important. The Secretariat of the Association was set up in Kathmandu, Nepal on 17th January 1987. SARC has 8 member countries. These member countries are also very important. Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Bhutan, India, Maldives, Nepal, Pakistan and Sri Lanka. The North Asiatic Treaty Organization also called the North Atlantic Alliance is an intergovernmental military alliance of 32 member states, 30 European and 2 North American. The Warsaw Pact was a collective defense treaty established by the Soviet Union and seven other Soviet satellite states in Central and Eastern Europe. Albania, Bulgaria, Czechoslovakia, East Germany, Hungary, Poland and Romania. Who said the function of science is to describe and that of philosophy is to explain. Therefore, philosophy is called the science of science. This is M. N. Roy. M. N. Roy was an Indian philosopher, revolutionary and political theorist who played a significant role in the founding of the Communist Party of India. He later developed his philosophy of radical humanism advocating for individual liberty, secularism, and social justice. Who said it is better to suffer wrong than to do wrong? Hanna Ardent Hanna Ardent was a German-born American political scientist and philosopher known for her critical writing on Jewish affairs and her study of totalitarianism. Famous works, The Origins of Totalitarianism, 1951, The Human Condition, 1958, On Revolution, 1963, The Life of the Mind, 1977. What is the Henderson Brooks Bhagat report primarily focused on? This question is related to international politics and this is one of the most important topics of international relation. The correct option is reviewing the Indian Army's performance during the Sino-Indian War 1962. Let us know some important facts about this report. The Henderson Brooks Bhagat report or the Henderson Brooks Report is the report of an investigative commission which conducted on operations review of the Indian Army's operation during the Sino-Indian War of 1962. It was commissioned by General J. N. Chaudhary, the acting army chief at that time. Its authors were Lieutenant General T. V. Henderson Brooks and Brigadier Premindra Singh Bhagat, a victim. Victoria Cross recipient and former director of military intelligence. The report was mainly written by Brigadier Bhagat. How many phases were there in the Hawthorne experiment done by Elton Mayo? 
फोर ऑप्शन सी इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन देर आर फोर सेपरेट एक्सपेरिमेंट इन हॉथन स्टडीज इलोमिनेशन एक्सपेरिमेंट रिले असेंबली टेस्ट रूम एक्सपेरिमेंट एक्सपेरिमेंट इन इंटरव्यूइंग वर्कर्स बैंक वायरिंग रूम एक्सपेरिमेंट थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब